Peace family, it's your brother, Julian the General Smith Jr. Checking in from the campus of Morris Brown College, which is in historic Vine City, which also sits on Diamond Hill. And what you are looking at family is the commencement of restoration work on historic Fountain Hall. Now this particular sign that you see is a symbol of the grant program of African American civil rights, which is part of the federal government, the National Park Service, because Fountain Hall is a national landmark. As you see, historic Fountain Hall roof replacement and clock and bell tower repairs. We are moving forward on the restoration of historic Fountain Hall. This is the movement, this is the catalyst of manifesting a beloved community on MLK Junior Drive that our martyred prophet, Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. would be proud of. This building is where Dr. W.E.B. Du Bois was a professor of sociology where he wrote The Souls of Black Folk, where he wrote Black Reconstruction. In 2020, we have 2020 vision on the beloved community. We have 2020 vision on the revival of Morris Brown College. And with the movement to restore historic Fountain Hall, we have the ability to unite the Atlanta University Center as this building is one of the original buildings of the Atlanta University, which Dr. W.E.B. Du Bois was professor at the Atlanta University. The Fountain Hall Redevelopment Project Strategic Supporters, the National Trust for Historic Preservation, which is a national nonprofit that advocates for historic preservation, receiving the funds for this project on behalf of Morris Brown College is ASALA, the Association for the Study of African American Life and History. We are proud to be able to organize ourselves in restoring this iconic building built in 1882, shortly after the Civil War in order with intent and purpose to educate newly freed slaves after emancipation. This project is also supported by the Morris Brown College Administration. We also are partnered with the Georgia Trust for Historic Preservation, which has listed Historic Fountain Hall as a place in peril. And I serve as co-chair for the Friends of Fountain Hall and we are a volunteer group that is committed to the organization and mobilization at the grassroots level to fundraise through our website www.fountainhallatl.org through crowdfunding through various events and online strategies this is the movement, Black Atlanta. This is the movement, supporters of Black Atlanta, for you to get involved with, for you to learn about, for you to say, hey, I am part of a tangible, strategic, visionary movement that will help develop a prototypical model of a beloved community that Dr. King would be proud of. And right next door to Fountain Hall, Gaines Hall is being rest restored. And on MLK Junior Drive, this is how we are going to start here, set up camp for the movement to create a beloved community. Further uh, of distance, uh, Gaines Hall is Herndon Stadium in honor of Alonzo Herndon, who was the first black millionaire in Atlanta whose home is walking distance from this iconic building, which it, it, in restoration is a global 
destination for civil rights and is Atlanta's national landmark and in restoration will help to revive the beloved Morris Brown College because it will serve as a center of excellence. It will serve as an income generator for the institution dedicated to the education of black people. Historically black college and university, HBCU. Now is the time family to get involved, to get engaged, all hands on deck. It's your brother Julian, the General Smith Jr. And now it's time for each of us to be a leader, a general or a soldier in the movement to educate black children. I love you, peace, power, prosperity. Where do we go from here? This is what Dr. King spoke to us about. Movements like this, nonviolent movements that educate, that uplift culture and service, that plug us into our history, that plug us into our community, that plug us into the politics of our community, of our county, of our city, of our nation. Peace.